Normally when performing maintenance on an inline valve, you start by digging out the valve box. This video is going to show you a faster, more efficient, less destructive method where you don't have to remove the valve box. Dwayne Smith here for Sprinkler Warehouse. Let's get started. Under this lid, one of the valves in this manifold is leaking. The seal has gone bad. And as with any valve repair, we start by cutting the wires. Since the bad valve is part of a premium manifold, all we have to do is loosen the unions and slip out the valve. Attach the unions to the new valve. Siphon out the water that is drained into the valve box. Simply slip the new valve into place and screw together the unions. As you tighten the union with your wrench, be careful to not cross thread or break the fiber reinforced plastic unions. Now reconnect the wiring. Remember, it doesn't matter which solenoid wire goes to the hot or common wire running to your controller. Using silicone filled wire connectors will protect your irrigation system's electrical parts from shorts. Replace the lid and you're all done. Quick and easy repair. Remember, Sprinkler Warehouse has everything for your irrigation needs so your trees, lawn, flower beds, and gardens are lush and beautiful. And if you have any questions about our products, chat with one of our amazing customer service agents on sprinklerwarehouse.com. They really know their stuff and they will get you squared away. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for helpful tips, tutorials, and general sprinkler instruction. I'm Dwayne Smith for Sprinkler Warehouse, professional quality, rock bottom prices, 